Yo, what up everybody, it's your boy Uncle Jesse. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and do our pack random for a box of Phoenix football. Pack random number two. All right. So, what I do is I open the box, take the packs out, number each pack, and then I random them to everyone that bought in. So everyone gets to keep a random pack. Shuffle them up a little bit. Are the Steelers for real? I got. I gotta look at that Steeler schedule. I have a feeling they haven't played a a good team yet. That and I just want to annoy JMS. <laughs> All right. So this will be one. Two, three, uh, Raiders crushing the Broncos. Yeah, what's the deal with the Broncos? I thought they were going to be better this year. Well, wow, Herbert had a man wide open in the corner of the end zone and overthrew that ball pretty badly. All right, all packs numbered from 12. So the Ravens are the only team the Steelers have actually played that are worth talking about. Because the Titans are fool's gold. Alright, we're going to do ones or twos, so roll again. We're going to go five times in these randoms, so randoms on the screen. And let's put the uh, people in the breakup too. And there they are. All right, before I start, good luck, everybody. Thank you, Isaac. All right, let's do this thing. So I'm going to random the names, then I'm going to random the packs, and then we're going to match them up. Here we go. Five times each. Money shot five. Boom, five. So copy and paste. Now we copy the packs. And paste them there. Uh, money shot five. Let's go five. Uh, touchdown. Ooh, he dropped it. Oh, that should be no touchdown. He dropped that. But I guess once he crossed the plane, it doesn't matter. Well, if things uh, continue the way they are, the Dolphins and the Bills will be playoff teams. And we might face, you know, you might face one of us in the playoffs. And uh, I, li I like the Dolphins' chances against the Steelers. I like our chances. All right, so uh, now that we matched them up, let's sort them out. And there we go. Ooh, Jordan. Uh, <laughs> J-Mess with his panties in a bunch. Don't talk about his Steelers. Watch out now. <laughs> uh, <laughs> All right. Jordano pack 11. Shane 9 and 4. Ryan 3 5. Michael 8, 10, 12. Greg 6. Brad 7, 2. And Ashley 1. All right. So let me actually uh, distribute those. Yeah. I, I mean, actually, I did hit my head on a rock, but that was years ago. Doctor said I'd be okay. 72 dolphins sweating. <laughs> okay, buddy. Even if you go undefeated in the season, you still got to win the Super Bowl. All right. Nine and four for Shane. Ryan, 
Hugh Smith. Three and five. Three and five. Ain't nobody worried about the Steelers. <laughs> ah, that's adorable. No, but props, props to them for uh, taking care of business and uh, winning the games they're supposed to. All right, 8, 10, and 12 to Michael T. Greg 6. All right, is the Steelers defense really the number one defense or... Or what? Bradley got seven and two. Seven, two. Ah, that's why Breeze was out for the second half. And rib injury. Damn, well, I hope, uh, hope it's not too serious. When do, do the Chiefs play the Steelers in the regular season? Or are we looking forward to the playoffs already? Anyways, I look forward to pulling something nice for someone in this box. So, here we go. Good luck, everybody. <coughs> Thank you, Isaac. All right, pack one for Ashley. Good luck, Ashley. Got Denzel Mims for the Jets to 175. Jets do have that nice home field advantage. No one wants to go to Pittsburgh anyway, especially in January. Minshew flamethrower insert in a rookie base for Mr. Malcolm Perry. And that's gonna do it for that. So looks like the uh do the Chargers have any timeouts? They do not. Oh it looks like victory formation here for the Dolphins. That's five straight W's for the boys. Yeah, JMS, I was just thinking the same thing. I was like, man, that, that, that undefeated pressure is definitely pressure. And so I, I would just lose the game just to get it out the way. <laughs> Dude, the Dolphins are six and three. I would have never thought. I thought we'd be like four and five by now. All right, we got Tannehill to 149 Titans. Tua's, you know, Tua doesn't put up gaudy numbers. He just goes out there and does enough for the W. And that's all we need. Man, I can't remember the last time the Dolphins were six and three. I think the last time the Dolphins were six and three was, I think, 2010 or 2008. When we debuted the uh, the Wildcat, that was probably the last time. All right, last pack for Bradley. We have Clavon Chason with the rookie color burst. Now all that matters is the W. I'm sure Herbert had better numbers than Tua, but he's gonna go home with that loss. Clyde Edwards Alaire or the Chiefs to 299. See, the thing with this Dolphins win streak is we haven't really played anybody. Like, aside from the Cardinals, but even the Cardinals, they're like, ah. Uh... So I, I still don't know where this Dolphins team is at, really. Who do we play next week, Freak? Could you look that up for me? 
All right, nothing too crazy there. I mean, the, the LR was nice. Okay, Brad. Thank you, man. I appreciate you. Next is Greg. We play the Broncos next, then the Jets. That should be two straight victories. I say it should, but you never know. That's why you play to win the game. Who do we play after the Jets? Speaking of the Jets, Dr. James Morgan of the Jets. Give him a start. Why not? See what he's got. Number to 75. We play the Bengals after. So we got Broncos, Jets, Bengals, and then the Chiefs. So the Chiefs are going to be the true test. We're, we're, we're really going to see where this Dolphins team is at when we play the Chiefs. Then we play the Patriots. I'm not worried about them. The Raiders are for real, and so are the Bills. Okay, interesting, interesting. Bills is the last game of the season, so we have, let's see, Broncos, Jets, that's a win. We'll beat the Bengals. I predict the upset against the Chiefs. We'll beat the Patriots. We'll lose to the, no, we'll beat the Bills. I mean, we'll beat the Raiders and lose to the Bills. Or fuck that, we run in the table, baby. That's what we about to do. Who am I, who am I kidding? All right. Michael T time. I'm gonna go with pack twelve. Now all jokes aside, we'll probably lose to the Chiefs, probably lose to the Bills too. But I like I like our chances against everyone else. Uh yeah, I'm doing pack randoms, Jameis. I gotta sell all spots before I you know open the box. But yeah, yes, Jameis, yes. Times are hard and you gotta figure out ways to get stuff done, you know what I'm saying? Pay a Manning on 175, Fire Forged. T. Higgins to 75, Relic for the Bengals. Rookie base, Darren Brooks. Okay, what else? Uh, pack eight for Mike. Hurricanes won last night. Dolphins won tonight. Good weekend. Jalen Hurts with the rookie silver for the Eagles. That's nice. Got Clyde Edward Delair of the Chiefs. Pink, that's the 199. Ed Reed, the Fire Forge, the insert. Dolphins Raiders might be for a playoff spot. You're not lying, man. So after that Bengals game, we're gonna see what the Dolphins are really made of. I mean, I hate to write off the Broncos, Jets, and the Bengals, which are our next three opponents, but. I, I like our chances. I like our chances. <clears throat> Just got to take it a game at a time. All right, we got a red Joe Reed. It's 299. I don't know kids play, but the man's starting to lose it. He's starting to lose it. Right, what else we got here? We got a Kenny G hot route. For the Lions, that's not numbered though. And the Eno Benjamin rookie. Man. Sorry, Mike. I thought you, I thought with three packs you would get at least one autograph. But you got uh you got some parallels and you got a relic. Yeah, Jalen Hurts is nice. So is the Allaire. Alright. 
What's the uh, Sunday night game tonight? I hope it's a good one. All right, Ryan. Thank you, Mike. All right, we got three and five. Silver for the Bears. Who, who's uh? What's the Sunday night game tonight? We got Larry Fitzgerald of the Cardinals hot route. Ten ninety nine. Baltimore at New England. Ugh. That should be a uh, total domination by the Ravens. Ooh, a nice Justin Herbert rookie rising for the Chargers. Gonna be nice, nice football weather. It's probably cold in Foxborough right now. If it's magic, Amari Cooper. Got Nick Bosa for the Niners. To 99. I predict Lamar Jackson breaks like a quarterback rushing record tonight. Gonna run all through that uh, New England defense. Fitzgerald, Silver, hot route insert. And a rookie Duvernay. There you go, Ryan. Thank you. Herbert was nice for sure. Would have been nice if it was a mink, though. So the RPA in the auto is still lurking somewhere. Oh boy. Shane, packs four and nine. Let's do nine. We got Khalil Mack to two ninety nine Bears. We got Antonio Gibson, RPA for the Redskins right there. Number to one forty nine. Nope. Yup. Rookie James Morgan base. Alright, what's the other one? Ooh. A Justin Herbert rookie pink. Which is number to one ninety nine. That's good for like a few thousand pesos. Noise, noise. Ah, dang. Shane got both autos in his pack. Wow. Very nice. Anthony Gordon, rookie auto for the Seahawks. Then I'm going to put me to your base card. This guy has so many collects. I'm glad that he plays with them at least. I got Apollo with me in the office, by the way, JMS. Your lucky charm is back. So if you're feeling uh, feeling froggy, you might want to take a jump. Take a dip in the pool. All right, Giordano. Let's see if we can hit you a one-on-one -on -one mojo or something stupid. All right, here we go. Uh, pink AJ Brown, which is number to 199. Apollo does not have any money, no. But I'm sure if I sold like one of his kidneys, he probably makes you know a few dollars on the on the black market. Uh, Justin Tucker, the game over silver insert for the Ravens, and a rookie base CD Lamb. And that is going to do it for the break. I was shocked to see 20 pesos equals a dollar. Wasn't it like 100 pesos to a dollar a few years ago? I don't know. I can't answer that question, honestly. Uh, but I, I do know that the euro is doing better than the dollar. 
and that's not cool Main, mainly because I'm competitive and damn it the, the dollar should be at the tippy top make the dollar great again people make the dollar great again all right thank you everybody that was the break I'll get your packs out to you